Hey everyone, happy Friday. It's Adeem from Hustle and Hooks. Uh, tonight's Friday night. Uh, we have a one-year-old and there's not much else going on, so let's get to work. Uh, tonight's gonna be a long, long night. We'll show you what it takes to get to these numbers where you're consistently selling about 10,000 a month. So it's uh, currently 8.20 in the evening and the uh, first great news, I found the mixers. Uh, we didn't inventory these yet, so we didn't have a location on our custom SKU and our eBay listing. I just went through uh, the items we recently listed and I found them. So that's the first great news of the evening. So tonight is going to be mostly processing. Uh, we will we'll do a quick what's sold. We have a few sales today to show and talk about, but it's going to be getting all this stuff listed that we've accumulated this week and catching up on some other items that we have laying around. So let's get to work and uh, start off with some easy stuff to kind of get the motivation going. So I'll show you some of the easy stuff, super easy to list, super quick. So here are the easy listings that I want to do first, just to gain that momentum to, you know, keep going and, and really put in some hours tonight. So these three pots and pans, this is a Farber Bear electric skillet and excellent condition overall. Mona did detail clean it. It's worth about 40 to 60 bucks plus shipping. So we're going to definitely get that listed. This small, this is a small Farberware without a lid. It's probably worth about 20 bucks plus shipping. And then a larger Farberware with a lid. It's worth about you know, 35, 40 dollars with shipping on top. And these two are super easy. I'm going to take a fan, um, a blow dryer, I mean, and I'm going to just heat up these labels. So they peel off easy. These are just front, back, maybe one picture of um, some of the details on here, like the warranty information or the model number. And those are super easy to list. This one's worth about 25 plus shipping. This one's only worth about 15 or so plus shipping. And then these three games I picked up about two or three weeks ago for $2 each. This one's worth about 40 plus shipping. And these are like 15 to $25 games. Uh, vintage games do pretty well for us. Um, sometimes they sit a little bit, but when we um, offer free shipping and we include that shipping charge into the total price, typically we move them pretty quickly. So these are the ones we're going to start with. We're going to get these listed and then move on to some other items. So here is the front of the fireplace. This is typically when we're putting in these long nights, we do a uh, before and after. So these are the two items that have been listed over here and we'll see how much we can actually get listed tonight. All right, the area is starting to fill up a little bit. So I've listed all these three vintage board games, a little bit of media, a couple of those uh, brand new things in boxes and all these pots and pans. And then also I'm working on listing all of these and I'm finding some really odd uh, comparable sales for these. Like some of these are going for like 30 bucks for the set of three movies. And then I'm also seeing like just these three going for like 80 bucks. So I'm trying to still figure that out. The nice thing is that I have those two that I paid 15 cents each for at a garage sale. And then also I have all of these uh, movies that uh, I have two sets that are completed and these are just extras. And I think, I think these sets are worth in this condition about $30 a piece. Uh, and then also wanted to share this one with you. This is one item that is made by Beachbody. And I just had a friend on Instagram message me and say, hey, don't list that you're going to get banned or suspended from eBay because Beachbody protects their product. So it's unfortunate and uh, people do get suspended all the time. They get warnings, but it's very confusing of what you can and cannot list sometimes. And so it's really nice to be part of this active community where people are looking to uh, take the time and message and say, hey, don't do it. Even though this has sales comps, you can still get varied or suspended for three days. Yeah, Beachbody, don't post their stuff on eBay. You can still sell it on, you know, Facebook Marketplace or Mercari um, and other platforms. So that's where we're at currently. And it's uh, around 11 o'clock at night. So after some further research, it looks like this one just does better, but I want to sell them together. So I listed both of these for hundred with free shipping. It's media mail, so it'll cost like three or four dollars to ship. And then this set is complete, but one of them is this full screen instead of widescreen. So I listed this set for 50 with free shipping. Uh, I have 30 cents into these two and 
two bucks each into these, so 12 bucks. These ones are, I'm gonna list as singles, um, but I'm not gonna do that right now. Because right now, it's uh, Christmas time. We have to figure out if these actually work. So this was the one we picked up at Goodwill for six bucks. And this bigger guy here, we picked that up at an estate sale, like a private pick back in like early summer. I um, just haven't listed it yet because of it's off season. Definitely vintage. I'm just not sure what year. This guy came along with it, this candle. This candle is 1994. So I assume it's about the same year. And then this guy is 1999. So I know this one's worth about 50 plus shipping. I haven't done my research yet on this guy. I think it's probably gonna be about 60, 70 plus shipping. And then the candle is probably worth like 25, 35 plus shipping. So let's find out if they actually work and uh, we'll find out together. So this first one, the top just popped off. Um, and I don't have that light bulb. So if it doesn't work, we're gonna have to order a light bulb. Let's see. Hey, look at that, it works. So that's a good start. And then these two snowmen, you just have to undo the backs to get to the light bulb. But I'm gonna try it to see if they work without changing the light bulb. We'll see. All right, here's the first one. And it looks like that light bulb is out. Let's check the second, second one. one. Hey, that one actually works. Looks like a blue light bulb in there. So that's good. So this one, I'm just gonna pop open and change the light bulb. Just wanted to share a tip. Anytime that you have anything that lights up or glows, try to get it, you know, in its best form so that whoever's buying it can actually see what it would look like when it's lit up and that it actually works. So in this case, um, in the listing, we'll put brand new LED uh, light bulb, works as intended. You know, it's, it's a really nice piece, it really is, but uh, it's best just to show it off. All right, give you an update on all the items that have been listed. So 17 new listings, some pots and pans, these blow molds, some DVDs and old games. So that's it for listing. Now let's see what's sold. All right, so it's about uh, 1 a.m. It's time to wrap up the evening. Uh, got all those listings done. I just want to quickly show you what's sold today. So we have eight sales going out and we'll just do them in order. So the first thing that sold were these vintage uh, peanuts puzzles. One thing I did disclose is that I did not verify that each one of them is complete. And these are from like the 70s and 80s. They have all sorts of different copyright dates on them. Um, looks like that one's 1975 is the last uh, year. So those sold for $35 with free shipping. We have about a buck into each one, uh, but you know, with the exception of these. So about $5 to $35 with free shipping. Next up are these vintage uh Tommy Thomas uh, tracks. I, I don't know how, much, how many there are, like eight or nine pieces. That sold for 16 bucks with free shipping. It'll ship for less than $5 with first class. About a quarter into these from a lot of Tommy, uh, Tommy the Train. Tommy the Train or Thomas the Train uh, sells pretty well for us when we can find like a bulk lot with a bunch of engines. Uh, those little engines typically sell for like 15 to $20 each, which is pretty Next neat. up, uh, only clothing item, uh, that sold were these Nikes. They're like a jogger, they're Nike dry fit. We tend to do well with dry fit Nike items. Those sold for $32 with free shipping. And again, they'll ship first class, uh, it's light. We paid $4 uh, at our local thrift store. Next up, we have a couple of pots and pans. This first one is an Echo. Uh, it's a stainless steel. Echo is not a great brand, but it's, uh, it's really hard to see the bottom. It's a uh, USA made. This is a really nice pan, but it doesn't sit flat and it's not the original uh, lid, but I found it at a garage sale for a dollar. Still sold for $30 with free shipping. It'll cost about $12 to ship it. On the other hand, this Emerald, uh, we bought a bulk lot of, I think four or five pans for $70. And this one sold for $45 with free shipping. Emerald is a really great brand. We've sold all the emeralds we've ever flipped. Uh, typically, they, you can only buy them in sets, so selling them individually, people really like it. Uh, it'll cost less than $10 to ship it out. Next up for $39, this is an original uh, rainbow vacuum piece. It's the dolly that goes underneath the, uh, the unit. 
we've parted out a couple of them and uh, we have about five dollars into this piece it's sold for 39 with free shipping it's gonna bubble wrap it a bunch and put in a large uh, poly mailer and uh it'll ship pretty easily for about ten dollars two pairs of shoes these uh sketchers sold we paid five bucks at our local uh, goodwill and those sold for $28 with free shipping. They might go first class. If not, it'll be about eight bucks to ship them. And then these sold really fast. This brand is uh, does really well in the resale market, the Salomon brand. Paid $10 for these at uh, Salvation Army, and they sold within uh, two days for $50 with free shipping, and it'll cost about eight bucks to ship them. So we're gonna go ahead and get all this stuff packaged. Um, thank you guys very much for watching. Really appreciate it. It's been a long Friday. Uh, pretty happy to get all these sales out the door and we're going to be working this weekend as well just keeping up with the business and keeping up with our listings thank you so much for watching have a fantastic evening